Hello, today we're playing Illusion of Gaia on the Super Nintendo. Uh, apparently this game is made by Enix. When I went to get it from uh, Emu Paradise, uh, it wasn't until um, I was at the website that I was like, I was like, oh geez. Uh, I thought, for some reason, I thought this was a first party Nintendo game. Uh, I remember this was on uh, the cover of Nintendo Power. And for some reason, that led me to believe that it was uh, a first party Nintendo uh, game and I just never questioned it. I never played it. I never heard of any, like I never met anyone that like played this that would have corrected me on that. Uh, okay, uh, diary. Um, 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 I don't know, let's just start. But uh, yeah, Emu Paradise doesn't have uh, first party Nintendo games on it. Oh wait, it actually does. Uh, you just have to dig for them. You have to go to that, um, you have to like click a game and then you hit it, or like you click on the um, the thing where it's like related games, and then the the first party Nintendo games will will sometimes show up in the related games or whatever. Uh, my name is Will. A year has passed since I went to the Tower of Babel with my father. My father and his party met with disaster. Uh, somehow I made it back to South Cape. Still can't believe my father is gone. I'll never believe it. That's okay. I mean, he's not dead. He's just gone. I mean, people survive disasters, right? Uh, when I grow up, I'll be an explorer and see the world. Somewhere I will meet my father. Oh, yeah, okay. He actually is possibly alive. But is he actually going to be alive, or is, it, is he, is he going to find out that he's actually dead? And he's going to be like, oh, he's actually dead. No, how will I ever continue? Uh, you four, do your best not to fall behind. Uh, demons have appeared outside have appeared outside of town. If you go very far, you must go with your parents. Okay, already kind of a strange uh, translation or whatever. Uh, I'll see you guys at the usual place. I have to go home first. I'll see you guys there later. Can I move? Okay. All right, we're moving. We're playing. We're playing a blind game. Woohoo. Uh, okay, our walk cycle is kind of strange. Uh, this game is 100% blind, by the way. Uh, like always, the cave. Like always, the cave at the seashore. seashore. Oh, that's the regular place or whatever. Uh, hello? Oh, well, please recite with me. Oh, my gosh. World shines on brightly through eternity. Okay. Okay, nice reciting, brah. Oh, my God. We're going places. What the hell? <laughs> uh, okay, we're in a dark space. Oh, yeah, I do, I do remember this. I've seen, like, little, like, snippets and screenshots and whatnot. I'm Gaia, the source of all life. I will help you on your journey. Only one with the dark power can see this space. You are the chosen one. The dark space, you can record a travel journal. Stop there before you depart. Uh, record. Yeah, I talked to somebody and I recited with my teacher. That's worth a save, right? My gosh, I have an attack uh, here. Alright, cool. What the hell is that? It's a baton or something? I don't know. Okay, yeah, I don't know why. I do actually re remember that. And also, uh, when I went to when I went on Emu Paradise, it shows like screenshots. I remembered one of the um, Hey Will, how many times have I told you not to come up here? You have a habit of jumping down from places. Well, I guess I can't really stop you. So I can jump down from like here. Oh, all right, cool. Uh, it showed one of the bosses that, that I actually remembered. I had forgotten about it, but when I saw it, I remembered it. Oh yeah, and the other screenshot, I think was like right here, and it said South Cape on the screen. And. I know that we have, like, our, our character has, like, two forms. I don't know if it's, like, an Altered Beast situation. I am the jeweler. I am the jeweler gem. You are the jeweler named gem? Then why is jeweler capitalized? I control the seven seas. Is that the name of your store? Or do you, are you just, like, the ruler of everywhere that is water-related? What's your business? What a weird way. Like, who the hell talks like that? I just wanted to see you. Oh, my gosh. Give you red jewels. Uh... I will give you goods for your jewels as written on the on the list. Oh, it's like the Tenda tribe. Uh, my secrets. Okay, I don't want to know. Is that right? How do you do? Once you hold up the red jewels, you'll have to come running to my place. I'm a famous master of disguises. If you saw me in another town, you wouldn't know me. Oh, this is the game's way of making you like talk to everybody because you don't know. It could be anyone. My god, why was that bird flying sideways? <laughs> okay, so this guy's just chilling up on a roof that has like a wall around it. 
Uh, okay, we're down here now. Feel sorry for Seth. I understand why. He hates to see his parents fighting every day. Oh my god, what was that? Oops. I didn't see what that said. Uh, Seth's, uh, Seth's father. Oh, that's him, what he's saying. What's wrong with having a little fun with my hard-earned money? Uh, because that money is for your wife. Didn't you know what you were signing up for when you got married? It's no joke, that man. I put up with it for Seth's, Seth's sake. But if it weren't for him, I'd have left long ago. Okay, so what, you hate him? It's like, well, aren't you supposed to, like, like figure out if you like someone or not before you open your legs and bang him and have a kid with him? Uh, my astronomer friend said something very strange. A star is approaching the Earth. Dude, what is up with these birds? Uh, this is Lance's house. He lives here with his frail mother. Uh, hello, Lance's frail mother. Uh, your father has been lost at the Tower of Babel for a year now. It seems like only yesterday. That's because you're frail and probably senile. My god, get out of my way! Oh, that's actually kind of cool. Yeah, the transition or whatever. Oops, I got a red, uh, thing. It said, was it... I think it started with a J. It was probably Jewel. It kind of looked like jacket. It was either Red Jewel or Red Jacket or something. It's probably Red Jewel, since uh, those were already mentioned. Okay, so Select brings up uh, our thingy here. Ooh, I have a Dark Power. Oh. Oh, these are my Dark Powers is. Okay, are these going to be the forms that I can take? Because I remember seeing, uh, like, a little clip. Uh, Red Jewel. Oh, I thought it was going to be a thing that we, like, collect a bunch of. I guess we are, but... Hmm. If we collect another one, maybe it'll just say two on it. Is each jewel going to take up its own thing? Are there only 16 in the game or something? I envy you when I see the sea breeze blowing your hair like that. Not like mine, under this scarf. I mean, you could you could take it off, right? Is that a thing that's allowed? You're allowed to do that, right? My friend Eric lives here. This is the biggest house in South Cape. Will envied people born to rich families. All right, in we go. Uh, it's little things in life that make you rich or poor. Yeah, the, the little things, such as money. Oh, excuse me. Well, heard any good stories? Okay. That was like two disjointed like pieces of text that they put like they they like assigned it both to the same NPC for some reason. Uh, everyone is jealous of this big house. It's nothing. We moved to this town before anyone else. Okay, well I mean if you worked hard and were able to afford the big house, everyone else can suck it. I mean it's yours, you paid for it, right? So like like why would any like I don't know, like as long as you got it, as long as you like like bought it honestly, like with honest work or whatever. Uh, don't worry, I'm not on fire. It's just a treatment for my sore body. Cleaning this big house all day makes my brain ache. Wait, why? <laughs> Would it make your body ache? But yeah, who fucking cares? They're just jealous. They're just haters, man. If they want a big house, they can go out and earn it too, like you did. Uh, how long have we been playing this? Uh, it's strange. Uh, this game is like red light, green light. Why are they doing that? I, like, that's the kind of game that, like, poor people would play, because they don't have, like, things. But I don't know why they're playing it on the, on this person's roof of this rich house. A uh, rich person's house. I'm worried there's been a lot of strange merchants lately doing business. Why are they strange? Uh, mmm, smell, nice smell. There's no stove, so I'm cooking in this pot. Okay, where's the, where's the heat source? Okay, is there a run button? I mean, you walk at a decent clip, I suppose. I raised the red jewel. Oh, I did a thing. I didn't see what that was. What did that do? Did I lose it? I hit a button, and now I don't have a thing to give to the, I was gonna give that to the guy. I travel around to people's houses selling weapons used to fight demons. We may live in troubled times, but I won't sell a weapon to a child. Even if he's got money. Okay, well, you're leaving money on the table, man. Oops, I didn't see what that said. I, I didn't hit any button. I, I think I 
I might have double tapped up, but it, it like I guess this game has a thing where it moves the text, like regardless of which button you press. It does. Even if you push the D-pad, it moves the text or whatever. Uh, welcome home, Will. Dinner isn't ready yet. Go outside and play for a while. Okay, what are you cooking? Books? Like, what the hell? Uh, coming home at this hour probably means you had to stay after school again. Aha, excellent. Even if a boy can't study, he should show a little initiative. Even if a boy can't study? Is that this game's way of saying that, like, even if he's not, like, intellectually talented, that he should still, like, put in the effort? I don't know. Oh yeah, it's definitely an Enix game. I do actually like Enix games. Uh, I played uh, Brain Lord as a teenager, so that game's like nostalgic. Uh, and I already let's play uh, Terra Nigma. That game I was blind, so I didn't have nostalgia for that one, but I did play that one as well. Oh, and I played Robo Trek. Uh, that one I played as a uh, young, it was like a preteen or whatever. So that game is like nostalgic too. And that was that was Quintet, I think, right? Brain Lord. Brain Lord was Enix, but not Quintet, I think. Okay, so where am I going? If I go back to the jeweler dude, he's gonna be like, Hey, why'd you uh, hit the wrong button, you moron? You made the jewel, like, like fly through the air. And now you don't have it to give to me. Oops, what did, what did that say? Oh, okay. I'm holding one of the red jewels for you. Yeah, I had a feeling that he said something like that. Okay, so I can just give you the thing that you're already holding? But you don't have any jewels. Let me give you some. Okay, so he gave me the red jewel back? So he's already got him? Once I use him, does it just go to him automatically or something? Yeah, I don't know. Okay, uh, can I leave? Gosh, I can't pull it up. Okay, well, quit being a little pussy bitch and pull that shit up, yo. Uh... Oh, you just walk through this board? Okay. Oh, this is the place we were supposed to meet. Oh, yeah, I totally forgot. <laughs> I was about to say, where do we go? But they said that right, uh, right, off, the, right off the bat or whatever. But yeah, I totally forgot. It was natural for the four friends to call uh, this sea to call this seaside cave their second home. Oh, okay. Uh, usually, when lessons were done at the school, they gathered there to talk and play games until sundown. Ah ha ha! I'm going to win again for sure. What is it, Will? It's late. Playing cards with Seth. Wait a minute. Actually, I actually have to wait. Suddenly, Eric rushed in with a desperate look on his face. What the hell is that thing on the right? I just noticed that a second ago. Was that always there? How did I miss that? <laughs> ah, news! Big news! The princess of Edward Castle has run away. Say she came to South Cape. That's all? He came in such a hurry that thought something really big had happened. Well, this is going to start our adventure, so this is actually pretty big. Uh, the princess is probably that spoiled girl, Kara. Is it Kara or Kara? Uh, the one you like so much. Liar! Maybe the soldiers will come here looking for her. The soldiers from Edward Castle look so cool. I want a steel helmet too. Uh, what the hell is this? Hello? Wait, you're just gonna tell me that that's nothing? Dude, that is something. That, that, that's definitely a something. And I thought everyone would be surprised. I'm not interested in girls. I like adventures better. Uh, we'll get over here and sit next to Eric. Uh, everyone's here. What should we do today? I want to see Will's mysterious power. If you haven't seen it? He can move things without touching them. Uh, he moved the statue that's in the corner of the cave. Uh, oh, excuse me. Will, show me again. Eh. Yeah, how do I mind it? How do I activate my brain powers? Um. Oh, look at that. I got DP. Got a little of that DP action. Can I not actually do it? 
How do I move it? The game hasn't, like, taught me anything. Oh, if you push the trigger, you do this. That's kind of cool. Oh, L and R both do that. Oh. Okay. Well, I thought that it was, like, a guarding move or something. I don't know. Uh, if only- if I could only do that. Next, pick a card. Any card. I'll put horse cards face down. Pick the one you think is the Ace of Diamonds. Oh, do I have, uh... Do I have, like, disability, too? To, like, see through the cards? Do I have, like, x-ray vision or something? Uh, pick the one you think is the Ace of Diamonds. Oh, they're gonna do the thing where it's, like, all of them. Oops. No matter how many times I see it, I'm still amazed. Why can you move the statue when you can't move anything else? Oh, they're gonna be like, oh, you can only move the things that we want you to move so that the game, like, works properly. Oh, let me guess. This is gonna be the Ace of Diamonds? It is the Ace of Diamonds, of course! What do you want to bet they all were? Ah, right. I'm speechless. Hey, Seth. Uh, this is some type of psychic power. Oh, yeah, I guess it could be that, too, right? <laughs> Not necessarily x-ray vision to see through the car to see the other side of it. Um, actually, if you had x-ray vision, you would just see through the card. You wouldn't be able to see what's on the opposite side of it, right? I don't know. I'm not an x-ray vision uh, canon uh, like expert or anything. Uh, yeah, it must be some kind of psychic power thing. Uh, if I didn't know better, I'd think it was magic. Most people have five senses. senses sight. Ear. Yes, we know the goddamn senses, yo. I think Will's psychic uh, power is some kind of sixth sense. You no, know, uh, people actually have, um, people actually have more than five senses. Uh, what Seth says is too complicated for me to understand. Uh, we have a sense of, uh, sense of balance, a sense of, uh, oh geez, there's like four extra ones. We have like a, there's like sense of, oh my god, I can't remember them. There's like sense, is it like sense of rhythm or something like that? And then there was like one more like obvious one. And then there was, like, one that I hadn't thought of. Okay, am I free to go? Am I being detained? Am I free to go? It was already something. Boy, anytime words appear on the screen, if I'm, like, if, I, if my finger is, like, about to press the, uh, the D-pad and words appear, then I'm just, like, I'm just gonna miss them. Uh, okay, so where do I go? I don't want to talk to everybody again. Oh wait, I gotta go. Is it here? Where they told me to uh, to come back later. The pig's wrecking uh, the room. But why? They probably said like, why is a pig here? Oh, that is a oh, it's a cute pig. It looks like a pig from like Harvest Moon. Or you know, it looks like the kind of pig that would be in a Harvest Moon game, if Harvest Moon had pigs. Uh, Hamlet, you shouldn't snort at strangers. Is this your house? Yeah, so? So why the hell is she in here? Frankly, you should... You look a little shabby. Yeah, well, you look a little bit like a big giant fucking cunt, so maybe you should just shut the fuck up. Uh, well, excuse me. Uh, your father, mother, not here, huh? Is this a picture of your parents? Uh, why are you in my house, by the way? <laughs> just gonna come here and be like, Oh, you look like a piece of shit. It's like, yeah, well, you look like someone who doesn't fucking belong here. Uh, my father, my father's an explorer. He, I know, Allman, the explorer, they say he was lost. He'll come back someday. Are you sad? No. I'd be sad if it were me. I'm sorry. Anyway, is there a piano here? I don't know, bitch. Do you see a piano? Uh, no, there isn't, but Grandma Lola is a great singer. Uh, they're singing upstairs now. They have such loud voices. I thought they said that my parents weren't here. Why are they actually here? Oh my, I haven't sung like this in a long time. Your grandmother, Lola, used to be a singer. I fell in love with her voice. That's why I married her. So what, your, her vagina had nothing to do with it? Okay, I highly doubt that. Uh, oh, you bringing up a thing like that. Will, you shouldn't be surprised to hear that. You know, having the guy's name be Will is, like, gonna throw me off. Uh, the girl who was singing with me a minute ago. 
They couldn't even have some, like, simulated singing to, like, make it believable that they actually were singing a minute ago. No! A scream from downstairs! It's that girl screaming! I think the pig has her pinned down and is having his way with her. A quick walk down very, very slowly. Princess, I've been looking for you. I don't know you, be gone. What are you saying? If I don't take you home, I'll lose my head? What do I care if you lose your head? Princess, why are the exclamation points and the question marks so small? Uh, do, you think, do you think I have nothing better to do than chase you down? I must take you home, it's the king's orders. And we're gonna make a pit stop to the sex dungeon, no questions. Sorry I lied to you, I'm King Edward's daughter, Kara. I feel as though we've met before, as if we were good friends. Uh, no, I'm not gonna, like, be like, no, oh, I know her, so it's okay, you should let her go, because she's a friend of mine or something. I don't freaking know her. Wow, the music just goes back to normal. Be like, okay, now everyone's back to, like, normal or whatever. Uh, there's a big viaduct. What the hell is that? Is it a viaduct? A viaduct? I've never seen that word, like, ever. Under the castle. Your grandfather designed it. What, really? Oops, I didn't see what that said. There's a prison under the castle. It's built like a maze to keep the prisoners from escaping. I don't know, why not build it like a prison to keep the prisoners from escaping? I feel bad that I built a prison where people disappear and are never heard from again. Well, as long as you only put criminals in there, then it's fine, right? Enough serious talk, let's eat dinner. I made a delicious pie, let's sit at the table upstairs. What What's wrong with that? the table that you're sitting at right now? Do I actually have to, okay, I was about to say, do I actually have to go upstairs? They mentioned it, so I didn't know if I actually had to do it to progress. Oh my god, can you imagine? I wonder how, like, how many blind Let's Players of this, like, went, like, out and, like, it was like, where do I go now? What do I do now? And they, like, went around the whole fucking town, like, all over again, trying to figure out the person to talk to. Uh, we sat down to a feast of snail pie with whipped cream. I only got one piece, but Grandpa Bill ate half the pie. That night, Will dreamed that Kara and he took a trip around the world. Oh my god, this translation. Oh man, well, it wouldn't be an Enix, wouldn't be an Enix game if it didn't have a crappy translation, eh? Uh, and the next morning, something began to happen. Why does he look, like, surprised? He's got, like, a surprised look on his face. Man, I can't believe that I thought this was a first-party Nintendo game for, like, more than 20 years. You know, like, what the hell? Uh, good morning, Will. A letter has arrived for you from King Edward. This is what is written in the letter. Bring the crystal ring from Almond's things to Edward, Edward Castle. Sign King Edward. I've been in a bad mood ever since I saw this letter. Oh, well, I'll teach you a spell. When I'm upset, humming this tune makes me feel better. Oops. Ah, damn. They missed, uh, missed more text. That's pretty. Even though Will had never heard it before, it seemed oddly familiar. You've learned Lola's melody. Uh, okay, cool. Do I get an ocarina to play it on? Crystal ring, never heard of it. There was nothing like that in the luggage your father Olman left behind. Uh, maybe we could go to Edward Castle. You could see the princess. Heh <laughs> heh. Wait, what do you mean? Heh <laughs> heh. You're already married, dude. Ooh, there's a thing. How do I use it? B button to use. Use. He softly played the melody he had heard from Lola, but nothing happened. Oh yeah, it's just a regular ass song, right? <laughs> Do I have to like magicify it or something? My God, why is this guy standing in the ways? Is he supposed to be blocking there? Oh, okay. I thought he was an NPC that just like happened to like walk right there and was blocking me, but apparently I was supposed to go here. All right. Uh, where do you go? Uh, here, I guess. You know, the one and only place. Oh my god. Man, I had seen so little of the graphics of this game. 
If I, that, that one, like that screenshot of South Cape or whatever, if I had gotten a better look at that, I would have totally known that this was like an Enix game. The graphics look totally like Quintet or whatever. Uh, this is King Edward's castle. I must report this intrusion. Will shows the letter to the guard. The guest to the king, I'm sorry, you may pass. That's right, I may pass. Don't let it happen again. Okay, so now we're like in the castle and junk. Uh, recently, a hunter was hired. I wonder what the king is thinking. He's probably thinking, hey, I want to hire a hunter. Okay, well, this room sucks. Uh, go to the second floor if you want to meet King Edward. Uh, King Edward is having breakfast. Wait a while, then enter. Is that on a timer, or do I have to talk to the specific person that will magically make him finish eating his breakfast? Oh, see, so these these are like stairs or whatever, right? They go in the middle? No. All right, so this is downstairs, I guess? Okay, let's check the barrels. Uh, this is the underground prison. Innocent people can't enter. Okay. And up we go. Uh, so your will, you were summoned by King Edward. Be careful when you meet with him. Okay. I, I love you. <clears throat> Simple alert. Well, he's shy. I'm glad that somewhere in this world there was someone who was thinking of me. Oh, uh, yes. Yeah, someone you can be best friends with, right? Someone that you can just see as a brother. Uh, this is the princess's room. Strangers can't enter. Who is it? Oh, God damn it! It's just a shabby boy. Shabby boy with a very large erection. It's me, Kara. Oh, that voice. Let him in or I'll tell everyone your old nickname. Oh, pardon me. Please enter. Uh, you, yesterday. I was told to bring the crystal ring to King Edward. Terrible, it's terrible. Again, my father is trying to take something important from someone. I've escaped from the castle before, and now they won't let me go out. Recently, something very strange has happened in the in the castle. My mother has hired a famous hunter. It's ominous. God damn it! I feel scared. My father and mother seem to have changed. Uh oh, it must be Yakra, right? Uh, please save me. Uh, take me out of here, please. Princess, please come back, Will. Okay, anything in the panty drawer? Any dildos under the bed? Oh man, this room sucks. Your business is finished. Get out! No! Oh, wait, there is a run button. I can run. I don't know if that was like... I don't know, the game made me do that. That might have just been for like plot or whatever. Maybe we're gonna like learn the ability to run. At some point, I don't know. Okay, video game logic tells me that uh, he is now the king is now finished with his breakfast. Uh, the interview room is before you. Climb the stairs to meet the king. Uh, no, he's eating his breakfast, so the dining room is in here. Uh, hey, you were eating your breakfast. Where were you eating it? Shouldn't there be like some big ass table, some big ass like king size table? Uh, the king sent. You the letter. Talk to him. Well, I'm getting around to it, bitch. Just talking to you first. I'm just trying to be nice. Uh, your will? You look so shabby. Well, did you bring the crystal ring? I don't think I have it, right? To be honest, be like, uh, no, I don't have it. I don't know what you're talking about. How dare you say such a thing to me? Guard, throw this impudent weasel in prison. Then go to Will's house and find the ring. Do I just have to go to prison for a minute? <laughs> So was I supposed to... Ma'am, save me. Who's, who's ma'am? you say ma'am? Was I supposed to get the ring first? I'm guessing I would have gotten thrown in jail for, like, lying about having it. I wonder why I have to suffer so... Dude, nobody talks like that. <laughs> I wonder what will become of me now. Anyway, I have to think of a way to get out of here. We said go to jail and then go to Will's house. 
The way they worded it made it sound like I was, like, supposed to leave. Uh, this moss has seen thousands of prisoners come and go. These prisoners must have been encouraged by any sign of life. Uh, no, I highly doubt that, actually. I could probably move this ball thing, right? Nope. It's locked. Okay. Oh, double tap is run. Oh. All right. Okay, so. Uh, can I push the block? Soldier's whisper comes from a hole in the ceiling. Oh, God damn it. Oh, he's just saying uh, food time, I guess. We'll taste some of the bread. Bread is hard. It's the worst thing he's ever tasted. For some reason, he really misses Grandma Lola's creative cuisine. Uh, okay, well, you've only been in here for like, for like a minute, dude. Now's not the time to be like, oh, I already missed my life on the outside. At least I got this moss to encourage me or some shit. Time passes slowly, but the... The long day is ending. It pains me to think of the prisoners' feelings, not knowing what they should do. While I was trying to think of a way out, I drifted off to sleep. Ah, yes. Do the old sleep stand. I know your voice speaks from the flute. I have a flute, apparently. Oh, is that that thing I was twirling? That baton thingy? Uh, Will, this is your father. Ah, oh, my god. Uh, father? You were a cute child, but now you've grown up. Isn't Grandma Lola's pie delicious? Dude, I thought you were dead for, like, probably years. And then, now, like, this is how you, like, start the conversation after all these years? Oh, yeah, it turns out I actually had the ability to talk to you the, through the flute this whole time. I just, like, didn't. But no, I, I totally love you and shit. Uh, sure, Dad, where are you? I can't tell you now. I have something to ask of you. Listen. Yeah, exactly. I was like, you just... It's like, after all this, you're, you're not going to tell me where you are? I feel like you kind of owe it to me. I want you to save me. I, too, was once held in this cell. Look at the left-hand wall. And now, magically, there's a thing. This? Have you heard anything from Grandpa Bill? Grandpa, he was an architect. Grandpa knows the secret of that stone. Okay, so where did that actually come from? Like, where, like, it just appeared from, like, somewhere. Starting now, you will encounter a terrible thing. Do I have to pick up the stone your enemy left? What? Power of the crystal is contained there. Man, this story ain't gonna make any sense, is it? This is totally gonna be, like, in, like, an Enix game story, right? This is actually worse. I think, than the other two Enix uh, story game or games or whatever that I played. That power will prove to be your ally. Is this the same uh, font as Robotrek, by the way? Uh, that power will prove to be your ally. I do like the different color of uh, text or whatever that they have for the different characters. Uh, you must make a pilgrimage to the ruins of the world to find the mystic statues the closer you get to the crystal the stronger the evil power will be will no time quickly first to the incan ruins uh the flute's voice fades and disappears okay well now that we're all like caught up in shit uh oh hello i wonder if this is kara's pig well, look, there's a letter and a key tied to its tail. The letter read, Sorry to hear that you're in prison. It's terrible what my father's done, but hear what I have to say. I, too, am a prisoner in a prison of silk and gold. But tonight, I will leave the castle forever. You will also be free, Kara. I have the key! Okay. It's locked. I gotta actually manually use the key? Alright, fine. I don't know. You ever watch Let's Players and then they're, like, annoyed that they have to do that? Like, what? I have to, I have to like, go into my items and then, like, hit the use button? Like, gosh. I'm like, dude, just fucking... It's not a big deal, dude. Just use it. 
It's fine. Oops, I didn't see what that said. It probably said I used the key and the door opened or something like that. Like, oh, actually, I have to use the item in order to use it? It's like, uh, yeah, actually, quit being a big old baby, dude. It's not a big deal, man. I'm at the age where I'm like, gamers these days are so spoiled. They're like, so lazy. That they, if they have to use the use, like, button to use something, they're, like, pissing and moaning about it. I'm Gaia, the source of all life. Okay. Uh... Oh, when you defeat all the enemies in an area, you will get a jewel that increases your abilities. So no EXP? You just get a thing for defeating all the dudes or whatever? Uh, push the start button to see the locations of your enemies. Oh, is that because of my uh, psychic ness or whatever? Find the demons and defeat them. Uh, finished recording. Uh, then go. Okay. Alright. Uh, can I... Uh, no enemies. Must be in this area or something. I guess we're not, like... We're not, like, in a demon-fested area or something. Okay, why is there a cross or an up arrow? I don't know. Just waltz out, though, I guess, right? We, we, oh, I was just about to say, we still have to get past that guard, though, right? Oh, jeez, we're actually playing for real. Uh, is that monies? Or is that, do I have to collect that for experience? Uh, my HP power has increased. Uh, okay. When you defeat all the enemies around you, a jewel will appear. Yeah, it, I, it like, froze and it, I collected it, like, automatically. It, like, went to me. Oh, so now I have, uh, four and a half. I have, like, four thingies in the upper left corner and then, like, a small one, which is, like, I'm guessing, like, a half of one. Underground tunnel. Okay, we're, we're over on time, but I wanted to at least get the game, like, going. So, we'll make this first episode a little bit longer. Um, but yeah, like I said, um, oh my gosh, oh, we can actually see where the dudes are. Okay, so if I go down here, all right, are we going to get an actual, um, oh man. Okay, so that says, why does it say force? What does that mean? I actually don't know. Okay, so we, we, we just have like blackness around us. Are we going to get like some enhanced way of uh, being able to like see like where the walls are uh, and stuff? Yeah, I don't know. Uh, but anyway, I guess we'll wrap it up here. And uh, in the next one, we'll go through here and actually uh, get started. Uh, so yeah, I'm looking forward to this. Like I said, it's blind. But uh, yeah, like I said, I know we're over on time, but I just wanted to get to like the game part of the game, you know, um, before starting. That way, like we can start with the game part of the game on the next episode or whatever. So that is going to do it. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, please subscribe if you are not subscribed already. I appreciate it. Also hit the like button if you made it this far. And I will see you folks next time. Bye-bye.